Hey guys and welcome to another block spotlight. Now in this spotlight I'm going to take a look at the Fisher from the Mine Factory Reloaded mod. Now I've got one set up right here, but before we get to it, let's have a look at the crafting recipe. Now the Fisher is created using a factory machine block, some buckets on the side here, some fishing rods in the middle, and some plastic sheets on the top. Now the factory machine block is created using some stone and some plastic sheets. You get three for those and get in my uh, take in mind sorry that you need these for every my factory reloaded machine so you might want to make a couple of those now the plastic sheets themselves are crafted using some raw plastic which can be obtained by smelting rubber bars or rubber from any other mod all right so let's have a look now the fissure is a block a machine which does require power so i've got a redstone energy cell here powering it it has to be placed above a pool of water which is at least 3x3 three three tiles in uh, size and one tile deep. Okay, so let's have a look. So currently it's idling because I've got it turned off with the lever here and it's not working because of that. Now I have it supplied with energy and now when we turn it on you will see the idle will uh, the idling time will start going down now keep in mind the fissure does not work incredibly fast so uh, the speed at which it fish uh, fishes does uh, also uh, depend on how much power you supply it but uh, when the idle time is over it will start working now unfortunately it will not work until it get well it gets one fish so when uh, the work bar is completely full it will catch a single fish However, it will stop working after a certain period of time when it will continue idling and after which uh, it's done with that, it will continue working again. So it sort of depends on how much power you are supplying it. So I am providing it with 100 Minecraft tools per tick. So I will, let's see how far it gets. Actually, it looks like it might have a good chance of uh, finishing up a single fish now. Okay, there we go. So one fish and keeps going. So let's have a look here in the chest. So we've got a fish. So it will uh, eject the fish from the top there. Okay, so it got to 199 now and it was idling again. And now it continues once it's done idling. So as I said, it depends on how much power you provided, uh, how fast it works. But uh, well, you'll get some, uh, some nice amounts of fish eventually. So I do recommend setting up a couple of these if you want a lot of fish really fast. But yeah, so that's uh, quite convenient. So it'll keep working now. So if you provide with less power, it's possible that it will, for example, work in uh, units of uh, 400 work units, for example. So uh, then you'll you'll get fish a bit slower because it will idle more. But it depends on how much power you provide it. So currently, I've already got two fish in here. Of course, it will also insert these into pipes or just spit them out if you don't have an inventory connected to it. So that's basically it for this block. I hope you guys enjoyed the spotlight. If you did, please like and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video.